Although for most of human history, people have been connected with the land that fed them, today, this connection has been broken for most of us. The majority of people do not know where and when their food is grown. They cannot touch the soil or talk to the farmer who tends it. Food comes from stores and restaurants and vending machines. It has been washed, processed, packaged, maybe even irradiated and transported long distances. But this isn't the only way. Community Supported Agriculture CSA, along with other initiatives, seeks to shorten food supply chains and restore the connection between farmers and consumers in a way that re-socializes food and enables products to reach consumers embedded with valuable information. Community Supported Agriculture is a connection between a nearby farmer and the people who eat the food that he or she produces. The essence of this relationship is mutual commitment. The farm feeds the people and the people support the farm and share the inherent risks and rewards. Indeed, CSA is an innovative model of food production and distribution. It consists in a partnership between a group of consumers and a local proximity farm, where consumers pay for the costs of the production, usually for a season's term. CSA farmers are open for partnership, cooperation and communication with consumers. Together with consumers, by mutual agreement, farmers calculate the cost of production and of the weekly basket, plan the crop rotation and provide regular information about farming and harvest. Consumers are not just passive recipients of safe food. They actively participate in the collective management of the partnership. Their participation ensures transparency, equality, mutual assistance and democratic management of CSA. Consumers are not only citizens willing to cook and eat at home a variety of local food, but they are also partners sharing the benefits and risks. Usually, food distributions take place at a common point, with the voluntary assistance from one or more consumers. The CSA movement has developed in the second part of the 20th century in different parts of the world, starting with Japan in the 70s. All are different, but various initiatives share four essential traits. 1. Partnership CSA is based on a partnership, usually formalized through an individual contract between each consumer and the food producer, and characterized by mutual commitment. 2. Local dimension. CSA movement is oriented towards making the food production local again. 3. Solidarity. CSAs are based on solidarity between producers and support groups, and involves sharing both the risks and benefits of an extensive small-scale production, adapted to the natural rhythm of the seasons, a production respectful of the environment, and of the natural and cultural heritage, a fair income for the farmer to guarantee a dignified life. 4. The producer-consumer tandem is another key feature of CSA, meaning that the partnerships are based on direct person-to-person -person contact and trust, with no intermediary and hierarchy. In Europe today, more than half a million people participate in CSA partnerships and their number is continuously growing. Why? Participants in CSAs benefit from receiving fresh food from a known source, produced in a responsible manner of sustainable agriculture. The environmental benefits of fewer food miles, less packaging and ecologically sensitive farming with improved animal welfare. A local economy enhances higher employment, more local processing and local consumption. CSAs have a direct contribution to the support of sustainable farming and biodiversity conservation. What's in it for small-scale farmers? A more secure income, more time for planning and farming, as they don't have to spend time to sell their produces on markets. A higher and fairer return for their products. Increased participation in local community, opportunities to respond directly to consumers' needs support from partners, help with labour and planning initiatives for the future, trust and care. We hunger for a true connection to what's on our plates. We want to know who grows our food and where, how it's grown and why. We want to participate in a food system that is ecological, just, nourishing and connected to community. The CSA movement offers all this and more. Get more information on CSA in Europe accessing www.urgency.net or click the logos for instant access on different national networks.